and he's not here with me. He stuck on the shelves at Coons Market, Banksville Road. We both love the grocery industry, but I got to ask you, what's this Michigan stuff all about? Well, my buddy goes to grad school at Michigan. I uh, went up there and saw a game at the Big House, and uh, they're my second team uh, from Pitt. So you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna root for Michigan all the way. Last time a guy told me I'm taking you to the Big House, I said, "Can I get out of the car?" But anyway, listen, I want to talk to you about the Steelers and Le'Veon Bell. He did not report today. But you know what? Much better team with him. Do you think he's coming back? And obviously, if he wants to be a free agent next year, he's got to come back. Yeah, I think he's coming back now. I don't think he should be the starter right away. I still think they should give Connor the ball. And if he fails, then Bell should come right back in. What about the possibility? And our guest tonight on the Allegheny Health Network program, Medical Frontiers, brought up a very good point about both of them in the backfield. I like that. Uh, it's not something that Tomlin likes to do, but I think uh, they would be better off if they both were back there. And speaking of college football, Pitt's disappointing loss to Notre Dame. They play Duke coming up on October 27th at Heinz Field. What do you think? Should be another high-scoring game. We remember a few years ago, uh, it was quite a shootout. So I think uh, fans will be happy with that one. So if everything goes smoothly tonight on the air, you can give him all the credit because he's that good. All right, ladies and gentlemen, stick with us. Time now for the Allegheny Health Network program in conjunction with Highmark, a healthcare company, Medical Frontiers on KDKA Radio. Good evening.